This is a very important question that a lot of people ask today. Uh, sometimes it is asked because people are trying to find a way to appreciate how God might be working outside of the visible bounds of the Catholic Church or even of the Christian faith. And they might try to say, well, perhaps the Holy Spirit works through Christ for Christians and then apart from Christ is at work in these other religions to bring people to God. Is this a good or helpful way of thinking about the relationship between the Holy Spirit and Christ. I think it is a dangerous way to talk about it and a problematic way. Uh, and I'm not alone in saying this. Uh, in 2000, the Vatican released a very important uh, declaration, a clarification on exactly this question called Dominus Jesus, which says that there is no economy of the Holy Spirit apart from Christ and the Church. Uh, what that means is that, yes, God can be at work outside of the visible bounds of the Catholic Church. When he does work outside of those visible bounds, he is always still working through Christ and bringing people, whether they are aware of it or not, into a relationship with Christ. There is no salvation apart from Christ. So Christ is the only Savior and all who are saved are saved in virtue of Christ and through him. So uh, Aquinas gives us some very important resources to understand how this works as well. And for Aquinas, it's inconceivable to think of the Holy Spirit working apart from the Son and the Father. Why? Because they are one God. There is only one God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Father, Son, and Holy Spirit always work together. They can never be separated. If we could posit that the Holy Spirit were working over here and the Father and Son were not working there with him, then we would have destroyed the belief in the Trinity. We would, in effect, be positing that the Holy Spirit is a separate God. And that is false. So, how do we understand the Holy Spirit in relation to Christ? Well. The Father uh, speaks the, his word, the Son, and the Father and Son breathe forth the Holy Spirit. So wherever the Holy Spirit is and is at work, he is there as from the Father and the Son. And in the world, in the economy of our redemption, the Father sends the Son to become man in order to breathe forth the Holy Spirit on the world. That means wherever the Holy Spirit is at work, he is at work as the Spirit of Christ. He is at work to draw us back to Christ, to conform us to Christ, and therefore to make us adopted sons and daughters of the Father, conformed to Christ who is the perfect Son, the, the natural Son of God, we could say. So does God work outside of the visible bounds of the Catholic Church? Uh, yes, that is certainly possible, and we know it does happen in some cases at least. In every one of those cases, it is the Spirit of Christ which is at work, and that Holy Spirit is drawing all those that it aids towards God who is Father, Son, and Holy Spirit.